Gentle. <laughs> My turn at last. to lay low so they don't knock me. How can I get noticed this time? Oh. Nice shot. Is it my turn? What shall I do? Shall we? Here I go. Not bad. Is it my turn? Does it hurt? Calm down, Tsukika. I'll try to be gentle. <laughs> my turn at last. There. Shall we? I was careless. Ouch. Ouch. Ow. 
I need to lay low so they don't target no me. No dice. I'll try not to be a burden. Stay away from me, Lady Shushu! No dice! Watch me, Lady Shushu! Now everyone will think I'm weak again! Lady Shushu! Did you see me? I could be more useful! Check out my toe cams. Lame. I lost again. <sighs> That's three strikes. <laughs> I did warn you. Their combined powers as hero and demon lord were shockingly formidable. Even so, they were no match for my powers. Oh, it's all over. <laughs> Curtain on my life as an idol is about to come crashing down. You let me see a beautiful sight in the end. If I had one wish, it would be to claim the kiss you offered. Well then, let's go ahead and take care of business first. Let's brainstorm their preferences. Let's see. The man said he likes girls who dress like me. And she's into fairly modest maid costumes. Okay, let's start with the creeper. Um, all right, here we go. <laughs> it is unbecoming of my lord to avert his gaze to the ground like that. Is this the rumored paragon of a beautiful Japanese woman? A Yamato Nadesco? Am I dreaming? Perhaps you will feel better about all this if your dream comes true. Ah, beauty without equal. Behold, nature's incarnation of beauty. No, all beauty originates here. I thank you for the very kind words. Well, I understand that it is disgraceful to request something from you, my lord. Could you still listen? Yes, I'll do anything you want. Anything. It is nothing too grandiose. I wish for you to become my peon. Ooh. Having to answer to a modest, beautiful woman in a kimono. This is all of mankind's deepest desire. Please be patient. You shall know soon enough. Stop, stop it! This is scary! Allow me to change into something suiting your tastes. Uh -oh. I'm sorry. Please take good care of me. Another form? Yes, yes. Here's your outfit. I, I'm sorry. I put you through so much trouble. I'm so inconsiderate. Just hurry and change. Yes, ma'am. What the? Those are. What's up with your clothes? Uh, um, how is this, my lady? Oh, that's a cheap trick. You're just too darn cute. Yikes! Um, excuse me. Please forgive me, my lady. I'll do anything you ask. What? what what's with you? Maybe just one. Mind if I? Does my lady also want to mate's responsibilities? What? <laughs> Don't make me laugh to think of me serving someone else. Ugh. Yeah, I, I'm sorry. Oh, it's just so cute when she apologizes. Oh. But um, if you have the tiniest bit of interest, I'm sorry, but.
the case. I'm so super duper cute after all. <laughs> There's nothing super or duper about you. I mean, I'm overwhelmingly cuter than you. I think everything turned out well. If you remained blind to the truth, you'd be married and miserable for life. That would have been a train wreck worth watching. Ugh. I should thank you for that. When I think that I was a moment away from being his wife, oh, it makes my skin crawl. I thought the two of you would make a lovely couple. I got butterflies in my tummy when you almost kissed. Stop it! I'll get PTSD flashbacks. Gross. No, I really feel sick. They're really laying into you. Hmm. You simply don't understand the female psyche. She's hiding her happy embarrassment. I think you're wrong. Completely. No well-balanced girl would fall for a sniveling weakling like you. Well, however you spin it, don't forget that while we didn't get married, I was engaged to Alice for a time. What? Is this some kind of joke? That's null and void. It never happened. That period of time no longer exists. Seems I must put my money where my mouth is. I'm so sorry for this, ladies of the universe, but from now on, I will offer my love to one woman and one woman alone. Shut your face hole! You're so grimy! Poodle! <laughs> Whoa! Bullseye with a shampoo! Even though she's on the other side of a high wall, she's got incredible accuracy. Now we can soak our tired bodies in peace and quiet. Ugh, can you please, like, kick him off the ship? Hmm, how do I put it? He's your weak point. Oh, you've got a rotten personality. If you serve me wholly and dutifully as my personal maid, I might consider it briefly. I wonder just how long you'll be able to keep up that entitled attitude. What's that supposed to mean? Maids are a hot item these days, you know. Once you've conquered the universe, I might become more popular than you. <laughs> you serious? Um, I don't know about that. Oh, isn't that sad? The protagonist's peon is much more popular than she is. Such a tragedy. Altis! I was right the first time! I just don't like this dumb bimbo! Please leave me out of this. Ugh, this is so stupid! I'ma make you understand that your entire being is my peon! Prepare yourself! Wh what are you gonna do with those hands? D don't come any closer! out of hand. Should we stop them? If you try to stand between them, you'll just get dragged in. Just let them have at it. How do you like me now? Have you learned your place? Of the wicked and treacherous young Altus and her world dominating crimes. Temp. Entry 3. There is no deep meaning to the treacherous bit. I thought it made me sound devilish, so I put it in there. Hello again. Altus here. This time around, we swept in and made Fire World our own. However, I just realized that the people of Fire World are grateful for our subjugation, aren't they? It was the same with both the Sun and Moon worlds, too. Will this become a pattern? Is it just my rotten luck that whenever I try to stir up some evil, only good things come out of it? No, that's not allowed! I need to get back on my wicked path! Shushu is Shushu after all. I mean, even though she talks the way she does, she's not a bad girl. Still, she is conquering worlds. I just need to add an evil twist to it. Next time, next time I'll definitely throw some evil deeds in the mix. Count on it! Is it okay to write it like that? Hopefully people don't take it as dishonest advertising. Chapter 5. Overwhelming Size. 
In the biting cold, the group encounters something massive. It's boobs! Lady Shushu, we're about to enter Waterworld's atmosphere. Oh, that was quick. <laughs> this is G-Castle's true potential. If we go full power, moving from world to world is a cinch. Does that mean every time before this, you weren't running the ship at full power? Elka has taken the helm, right? I didn't think it was the same ship. Imagine my surprise to learn you of all people have expert piloting skills. Taking the wheel is one of man's finer tastes. In charge, safe, maybe a bit fast, and occasionally reckless. Any lady in the passenger seat is sure to fall for me. I don't think passenger seats exist in a large ship like this. Hmm, I was skeptical at first, but maybe it was a good move to make you into my peon. I'd prefer if you'd just strand him somewhere in deep space. Since we have both a good pilot and fighters now, it seems like Ryuto's usefulness has dropped a few levels. Hey, I'm trying my hardest! Don't leave me behind! <laughs> what to do? Should we really be chatting right now? Another ship might appear, or another pail might block us. I don't sense anything, and nothing's getting picked up on radar. Huh? There's a radar? Oh, Ryuto. Hmm, what to do with you? Um, no, I just forgot, <laughs> really. Whatever. If it makes things easier, I don't really care. Let's decide Ryuto's fate later. Shushu isn't here yet. I've succeeded. I'll make my peons and take them home. Wait for me, father. Here I come. Uh, um, so are we supposed to close our eyes when we do this, or...? No! No! That's not it. I, I mean, a wedding's atmosphere should be more romantic, you know? You're such a fickle pickle! Ugh! If you won't kiss me, I'll force my lips under yours! No! Stop! I, I don't want it non-consensually!
goodness! There's no way people can live in such a frigid place! You're being dramatic! Hmm. I suppose this is a big change for the residents of Fireworld. Hey, what's this fluffy white junk? It's super duper cold. It's everywhere. It must be a chemical weapon that freezes people. It's no. This is what happens when raindrops freeze. More or less. The rain can freeze? Cool! <laughs> it makes funny crunchy noises when you step on it. Playing in the snow. How long do you intend to make us watch you hop around? Let's get moving already! We should head for the nearest town and start asking around for information. Service. Look at me, 